set him up properly, I could probably do a, an arm bar as well, right? So I could go, instead of holding here, I could hold here, which gives me to that arm, and I can get into this position. But now look, I fed that, and I can choke him here. Does that make sense? So we can use the leg assist, right? I hold here, okay? Like I'm gonna do sliding lapel. Also, like I'm gonna do arm bar. This one stays here. He's not worried about it. If he feels me going for the arm bar, he might even make arm bar defense. That's fine. This is tight enough. I pull here. I can double hand it if I need to. And I pull. Does that make sense? Yes, sir. So I'm now using this leg to assist. If he starts defending with that hand on his lapel, he wants to pull his lapel free. No problem, I got the arm bar. Okay. Does that make sense? Yes, sir. sir. Try to get to the arm bar position without losing that grip. Then when you get like you're gonna go for the arm bar, this other hand grabs and assists, pulls on the one side only. You pin his shoulder so he can't roll, make the choke. If I'm in the right position, I'm ultimately gonna have both hands on this <coughs> lapel, this way, pulling here. I'm pulling his lapel across his neck, okay? So I start here. I'm gonna grab this. This is gonna be my feeding hand. It's not my choking hand, my feeding hand. I move to the side here, like I'm making an arm bar, right? Now I double hand this. You guys see how I've got two hands on it? Now, instead of me pulling hard here, I just use my legs and I push his neck into it. Does that make sense? <coughs> Sorry, Joel. Thank you, sir. Love it, bud. So I'm gonna show you, if we've moved too far, kind of what that looks like. I grab here, I secure. Again, I'm thinking this for the arm bar. For those who don't know this particular move, it would be this to the arm bar. That's the primary move. And I'm gonna trick him into a lapel choke, okay? I'm gonna hold this one, I'm gonna hold it. He probably isn't gonna like it. He might even be fighting his hand, doesn't even matter. I'm just gonna hold it. I'm gonna move the head here, right? When I get to here, notice I'm not, here, because now I'm pulling against his shoulder, under his armpit. He'll feel this in his armpit, not in the neck. See how I'm too far? You see how I'm, he's bound up here. You see how tight it is under his armpit? I don't want to be there. I want to be here so that I can pull into his neck this way, not that way, this way. So I get this here and I push his shoulder and I push his neck and I choke him here. Does that make sense? You like that, Ethan? Yes, sir. <laughs> so it's here. Okay, if I get too far and I'm pulling his armpit, see how you can see his uniform, I'm not doing anything to his neck. I'm pulling into his armpit, I just have to switch to this to make the armbar, okay? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Because you've moved too far to the side, you need to be higher on the body, pulling this into the neck, not pulling it across the chest. The uniform stops here, it's binding now. Pull here. That direction, not this direction. Try again. Yes, sir. 